Hello everybody, welcome back to the channel, and I will turn that down very slightly. Welcome back to the channel, freaks, geeks, nerds, and everything in between. If you're a history buff, this is the video for you. Um, and it will piss you off, the inaccuracies in this game. We are playing Medal of Honor Above and Beyond. I really don't want to play this, but, I mean, I needed a break from normal desktop gaming, and, um, yeah. I wanted something a little bit more realistic than what I've been doing. So, just so you guys have the full story, I'm going to start from the very beginning, and I'm going to skip, like, the tutorial part and other not-so-important parts. God dang, why am I not in the middle of my play area? <clears throat> because of the way the room is set up currently, for some reason it wants me to face this direction. Tunisia? Tunisia? Stay alive until Sergeant Ollie saves you. What the? Oh, hi. Can't believe you came back for the, us. Yep, my head's all the way back here now. Lives. Lieutenant, you took a direct hit. How do you feel? I feel fine. That move looks bad. I don't think the lieutenant can talk. I'm, I'm talking to you right now. Be bad. You fucking idiots. What you just did was both the bravest and dumbest thing I have ever seen. Oh, yeah. I kept count. You took out 11 of Rommel's best men. <laughs> oh. And. Oh, come on. Fuck me. I'll make that 12. Lieutenant, please try not to move. Can you. Can you what? Oh. Don't worry. We're gonna get you out of here. <laughs> okay. Oh, you came back for us. You saved our lives. Oh, fuck Lieutenant, off. You took a direct hit. How do you feel? I feel fine once again. I don't know why you can't hear me. I don't think the lieutenant can talk. Not be bad. Lieutenant, what Shut you up. just did was both the bravest and dumbest thing I have ever seen. Don't care. Don't know what I just did. You took out 11 of Rommel's best men. <laughs> I'll make that 12. Lieutenant, please try not to move. Sarge! Oh, Lord. Don't worry. We're going to get you out of here. You saved us. Okay, that's kind of cool. Before I could, okay. So for oh, I am not facing you guys. Can I drag this over? I can't. Uh, face this way. Where's the camera? Uh, for those of you who are not familiar with, oh, oh my God, the the directions they want you to face in this. Um, with Medal of Honor is is usually historically accurate. Um, Good morning, Lieutenant. I'm Colonel Ebbets. Welcome back to the land of the living. You've been through a lot, so I'll keep fuck it brief. You. Fuck I'm you. Fuck you. with the Office of Strategic fuck Services. You. Our mission is sabotage, subversion, and everything in the between. The OSS, okay. We're taking the fight to the Nazis. Going after the Third Reich on their home turf. We do some of the most dangerous work of the war, and we're looking for people just like you. Now, the sergeant and I go way back. He's an excellent judge of character. And for what you did in Tunisia... Are you going to suck his dick now, or...? For the Medal of Honor. Okay, Trust me, Lieutenant. Care. I hate doing paperwork. But in your case, I made an exception. You Am I lives. the ranking officer here, or are you? I have a motto. Life is usually a pageant of idiots and fools. But occasionally, you find yourself in the company of good people. And then... Anything is possible. The saying is in company of good Lieutenant, men. Lieutenant, you are now going to hear the most important question I can ask. Would you like to join? Fine, if it'll SS. get you out of my ass, sure. Excellent. What about you, gentlemen? That's simple. My problem with this game goes. is... Yes, sir. I have every confidence that you're Facebook going to make me it. look like a genius for recruiting you. But because Facebook made it, they Welcome made it to the PC, and they made it just the most just 
piddle farting around game I've ever played. I love Medal of Honor games. They're usually fun. But when you insert your political agenda into a game like this... Hello, Lieutenant. It I'm irks Dr. Me. Thatch. Welcome to the infirmary. Ah, we'll have you back on you your get snatched? in no Yeah. Time. Ah, I know you're having some trouble speaking after what happened in Tunisia, so let's just use hand gestures, eh? Uh, I, you know, if I had true finger tracking like I do in most games, I'd just flip you off, but, um... Facebook don't like that, apparently. Okay, I already set up my options, so we're gonna skip to the firing range. I am always here, Lieutenant, so please, come back any time. You got a Dr. Snatch. Access my office through the main menu. Good okay, luck, that's a terrible fourth wall break. Bye, bye, Dr. Snatch. Anyway, Facebook did not keep to historical accuracies. They made it super PC. It's not true to what World War II was and what it was about. It's... I played through half of the... At least half of the game, and there's just so much... That in real life, would have gone the complete opposite way. It's a fun game. Do not get me wrong. It's absolutely a blast to play. However, once again, once you insert your political beliefs or, you know, whatever beliefs, instead of sticking true to what history was and how things actually went in World War II and Welcome World War One. It was doom and gloom. It wasn't really happy and bright and really funny screen. and... Yeah, 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 I see it. Okay, yep. Your hand over objects. Yep. You can use yep. Hand. Now it's time to move, Lieutenant. I see you're right-handed, just like me. Good. Whoop. Makes this training easy. Look at your sleeve again. Whoop. The arrow always points in the direction you need to go. Yep. Use the left stick to move, the right stick to run. Press in the left stick. Let's move on to live fire training. Remember, anyway, you can always adjust your comfort and controller settings by pressing the pause button and accessing the option. All right, Lieutenant, it's time to shoot. Just let me shoot already. Come on. Is here. Grab the pistol from its holster. Squeeze the trigger to fire. Holding the pistol with both hands will give you more stability and accuracy. Nice shot, Lieutenant. Press this button. Excellent. Bring the map. Look at the squeeze. Now, let go of the pistol. A weapon will automatically return to its holster after you release it. Larger weapons will holster on your back. Reach over your shoulder and grab your M1A1 submachine gun. Tommy gun! I hate you. Look at that. The arsenal of democracy in action. Remember, you can always hold a weapon with both hands for increased stability and accuracy. Bam. Now reach over your other shoulder and grab fire away. M1 Garand. Let's hear that Garand ding. Happy now? Great, Let's move down to the Here's specialist What's up, bitch? Demonstrate some advanced weapon that looks painful. You might want to go get that checked out. On your hip and a larger weapon on each shoulder. When you pick up a new weapon, it will replace the one you currently have in that slot. Grab this easy piece <laughs> lemon squeezy. Car 98, bitches. From these ammunition boxes. Here's special... God fucking demonstrate some advanced weapon handling. You carry your pistol the K98 is a bolt action rifle. So you reload by pulling and pushing the bolt after a great work. Let's go to the next station. Lucky shot. I just want to piss off the Lamage here. Come on. I don't need a scope to hit this target. Okay, this is getting ridiculous. What? What, bitch? What, you mad that I'm better than you? Oh, come on. What? 
Sound a little salty there, uh, Lamouge. Seriously? Come on! What, what the hell is this? Stowed specialist. What, you mad that you can't be an expert marksman? All right. Cool. I know you just got out of the infirmary, Lieutenant, but we need to give you a quick refresher on battlefield medicine. Mm -hmm. You will mm -hmm. automatically heal from minor wounds, but if you really get hurt, you'll need to use some first aid. Pretend to hurt yourself by smashing your hand on these rusty nails. Okay. Oh, oh god, my hand. Oh. The Morphine! Oh, yeah! Ah, good as new. You can store up to three first aid syringes on your cuff. There are soldiers now on to grenades. Okay. Cool. Head up the stairs. Pick up an American grenade, which looks like a small pineapple. Whoop. To pull the pin, <laughs> use your hand or your teeth. Excuse me. Once you pull the grenade's pin, a fuse inside starts. Now pull a grenade off your chest. Oh shit! Ah! I'm good. Woo! Potato, go bye bye. Fuck. Stalin grenade. Damn. Range. I'm gonna get it. I'm gonna get it. Oh, oh, oh! Epic. Got it! Got it! Okay, well, barely got it. Okay. I'm good now. Firing range, huh? Spend as much time at the firing range as you want. When you're done, just go through the door to return to headquarters. Just let me fight. Seriously? Bingo! Eaten by bears! Shit. Oh. Okay. I'm I think I'm good. No, I'm not. <laughs> okay, I'm good now. Excuse me. Oh. Cutscenes. This has been musical interaction with Odie's. Ollie's age, learn Ollie's secret. Ooh. I'm thinking it's not so secret, Sarge. I mean, look it's at him. He looks right? young. Yes, sir. Boy, looks like he's 16. He doesn't even have hair Ollie, on his chin how yet. Old are you? I'm 23. Oh, bullshit. Bullshit. If you're 23, I'm, I'm the Pope. If you're 19, I'm the Pope. I'm 16. Bam. Got it. Told you. I told you I sorry. Every right to be here. No, you More don't. You, that's Get out of sure. here. Bye. The Nazis didn't bomb Abilene, Texas. They bombed London, England. They destroyed my home. They burned my entire life to the ground. I don't ground, think he heard now about I Pearl do the same Harbor. Thing to the Third Reich. Go ahead, turn me in. I'll find a way to get to the front. How do you think I got to Tunisia? Forging transfer orders has become a hobby of mine. 
I will make it to France. See, kid, uh, this just ain't your time. I'll let your secret safe. I'm pretty sure the really? lieutenant isn't gonna say anything. Well, I kind of can't. Apparently, you Such dip fucking shit. Thank you, lieutenant. But oh, I am. Fuck you. Keep your head down and do exactly what I say. Yes, sir. You don't listen yeah, to me. Yeah, put him in his place since I can't. Apparently. I'll turn over to the Germans myself. Understand? I understand, sir. I won't disappoint you. Don't look at me. Neither of you. I will fucking shoot your cat. Somehow Shut up. This motley crew has been tasked with saving civilization. God help us all. They're right. You guys can't even answer on basic English, apparently, because I'm sitting here talking to you fuckheads. I'm sorry. I love VR. I get carried away in VR. Especially when they give you a role like this where, you know, your character, your protagonist, the person you are playing as, has nothing to say. They can't say shit. I can make up my own voice lines. Oh. All right. Enough talking, training, and tests. It's time to go after the Nazis. We're it's a lighthouse. To occupied France. <laughs> yes, sir. Your first mission is to make contact with the French Resistance. You'll be working with a cell led by Manon Batiste. We've been our eyes and ears on the hey, ground since the war the compass started. is broken, dude. Your rendezvous will be along the coast. You might want to get this Catherine fixed. Lighthouse. It's Germans not working. Using as an observation post. The resistance uh, yeah, will give yeah. you a signal when it's safe to come ashore. You'll have three days to assist the resistance. Gather intelligence on German activity and sabotage targets of opportunity. I'm talking about a small communications relay or a fuel truck. Blowing up a train and destroying the Stapo headquarters. This is your first OSS mission. Why does that sound like foreshadowing as hell? Now I want to introduce you to Huxley, our quartermaster. She'll get you set up. Hi, Huxley. Need, she'll give you some nice goodie bags for the resistance. You have a gremlin face. Three days in and out. Keep it simple. I'll see you on the other side. Dismissed. Cool. Sorry, she has a bit. She means to be a gremlin face. It might. I think it's the hat. The hat really doesn't do her any favors. I'm a load. Shouldn't take this long. Yesterday, I think I stood at this loading screen for a good 20 25 minutes. Just waiting. Yep. I don't know why Facebook thought it was a good idea to have really long load screens, but just saying, it's not the greatest idea, Facebook. It's not the greatest. Quartermaster! Hello, I'm Huxley, your Ooh. quartermaster. I need Armory. to brief you on weapons, gear, and all the threats you'll face. Backed up by a full metal shop, a sewing brigade, and the best <gasps> gunsmiths the Allied nations have to offer. Have a look around. I'll be happy to answer any questions you have. Is this real? Oh, yes. Oh, yeah. Hey, who said you could walk away? Okay. Okay, I got it out. I got it out. We're good. I'm good. I promise I'm good. <laughs> um... Well, Marcel special. This is quite the treat. Your friend Marcel made this custom for you in his workshop. I don't know who Marcel is. Talk about something that goes boom. It's easily the most lethal sidearm we have at close range. Then it comes with a massive bullet spread. There's also an intense kickback when firing quickly one-handed. 
Either hold it with both hands while firing, or take a short pause between each shot to account for the recoil. Spent pearls can be ejected by simply jerking the weapon in any direction. After new pearls are loaded, the barrels can be reset in the same one handed way. Okay. My 1911. Ah, your trusty sidearm. The keep semi automatic that. 1911 A1 pistol. Reliable and accurate. It's quite useful at mid to long ranges with both hands. Uh, and mid this to does not look like a. Hand. Sometimes you just need mm. a shotgun and nothing else will do. At close range, this does not look like a Winchester model 1897. You have to pump the shotgun after every shot. Try doing it with one hand by making a brisk up and down motion. With some practice, you'll be able to pump your shotgun with one hand while throwing a grenade with the other. Germans will run in fear and speak your name in whispers. Shotty! <laughs> okay, that was brilliant. I'm sorry. Okay, I'm satisfied. Uh, you were 43, which is basically an SKS, right? No, no. Maybe. No, an SKS is completely different. With a larger magazine. Every bit is accurate to the other semi-automatic weapons, but rapidly firing the Gewehr's entire magazine has accuracy to go wild. Okay. Uh. <laughs> the MP40, Look. a deadly German submachine gun. I'm, I'm going to say this one time, and I am not apologizing M1 about it. A1. But in the right hands, it can be more. The, the MP40 Fox compared to the Tommy the gun. Lowest firing rate among all However, the MP40 doesn't go wild like other automatic weapons. Higher. Why the Germans love it. Damn it. I missed. Alright, uh, what do we got next? Uh... This special weapon is on loan from Colonel Ebbets. Apparently it's a family <laughs> Uncle Nate Rough Rider. I call it an exquisite Nazi killing machine. It can be fired entirely one-handed, with only minimal impact to accuracy. And it's the only weapon in your arsenal that can be reloaded entirely one-handed. While slightly less lethal than a bolt-action rifle, it's deadlier than any semi-automatic. The Rough Rider is best for mid to long range combat. And it can be slam fired by holding it two-handed while keeping the trigger straight. I don't care about slam fire. Just remember um, to the after every shot. The sergeant already told you how this. much he loves the M1 Garand. Everything he said is true. It's reliable, accurate, easy to reload, and nice. easy to aim. In the right hands, the simple combat knife is every bit as deadly as a machine gun. A knife is always lethal when thrown at enemies. Ah. If your knife ever gets stuck on the ceiling, you can always shoot your weapon to dislodge it. And with a little practice, Where did it go? the knife can be twirled and tossed between hands. I don't know where it went. Packed tight with explosives. Grenade Woo! is a small bomb. Gammon grenade, huh? Weapon carries a lot of risk. I don't remember but this weapon from history the class. This is a massive instantaneous explosion <laughs> at the point of impact. All right, sorry, I'm done messing around. Any surface. Hi, Ollie. A Nazi. After the cap is pulled. The gammon grenade can be held Dynamite. Bing. Now that it's armed, there's no going back. Make absolutely 
absolutely sure you throw it far enough. Otherwise, you will have a very bad day. When conducting sabotage in the field, you'll often attach explosives to your target. In lieu of dynamite, practice attaching one thing to another with this decidedly non-explosive piece of paper. Then, light it on fire. Oh, God! I asked the boys in the back to set up this ladder for you. You've been in quite a while, so... Alright, bye, Huxley. Don't care. It's the, uh, guide game to get to. Oh, how long have I been playing so far? Eh, not that long. It's only 11.30. Cool. Make contact with Manon Bati Bat Batiste? Batiste? I don't know. Keep an eye on the lighthouse. We're supposed to look for a signal. I guess that's it, huh? Works for me. I like it. Subtle and loud and beautiful. That explosion got hey, the attention whoa. of all the German patrols in the area. This place is about to be crawling with Nazis. Good, give me something to shoot at. I need you to eliminate all incoming enemies while Ollie and I help Mano with the supply. A code book. Excellent find, Lieutenant. Hi, boys! How you doing? Shit! I don't like the Thompson. That didn't sound right. Fine, you want you want to play that game? I can play that game. Oh shit! Ow! God damn it! Oh hell yeah, give me that MP40. Fuck yeah! Hell yeah. I need to find more secrets! Oh, Panzerfaust. Hell yeah. The last of the German patrols. Good job finding that enemy code book. Always keep your eye out for code books and reconnaissance folks. No. No, Every I need to get to the shed. Will help us win the war. And who knows, you might be able to liberate some music for your record collection. Stand by, Lieutenant. We're heading your way. I don't want to stand by. I want to go kill some more Nazis. But dang. All right. Let's go, come on. But then I wanna kill more Nazis. I'm still trying to figure out who the ranking officer is, cause he he talks and acts like he's in charge. I'm I'm the lieutenant. Lieutenant is a higher rank than Sergeant. Last time I checked. So why he's giving me the orders and he's giving me the recommendations for the Medal of Honor, I have no fucking clue. Secret base. Oh, secret, secret. Tell me your secret. This is our base of operations. The village of Debuisson. She's Most actually kind of pretty. Good, but for, for video you game must model. operate in the shadows. You never know where the Gestapo has eyes. She looks crazy, though. Why the Gustavo? 
Where did we stop all eyes? Every neighbor into a possible enemy. That's terrible. I have eyes in my face I holes. Anything to get the Nazis out of my country. The Third Reich is ruthless, but so is the French Resistance. Resistance! We are the Resistance. I grew up here. My old school teacher still lives in that house. My grandpa was the village tailor. My parents owned the bicycle shop. That's the boucherie. Where my brother worked. Excuse me. And here we are. Our secret base. Secret, secret, give me your secrets. Yes, yeah, totally inconspicuous, just riding in with a few American soldiers in tow. Where anybody could be a possible Nazi conspirator. Oh yes, this doesn't... You, you guys do realize you have a big-ass glass window over here where, you know, anybody can see in at what's going on here? Oh, Jesus Christ, y'all are geniuses, ain't you? Fuck. Welcome to my bookstore. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Marcel has a special workshop upstairs. For things you know, like the boom. <laughs> we have a serious problem. Something big is happening inside Gestapo headquarters, and we don't know what it is. Against my wishes, Juliette works inside, undercover as a clerk. She's seen a dramatic increase in radio transmissions and coded messages. What's it all about? They have something. I don't know what. Can Not I at least see the pictures? Like... I can't get near it. They've even brought in the Waffen SS. We need to find out. But our usual a Nazi's a Nazi lady. has suddenly gone quiet. He knows what's going on. Is he a high-ranking German? Worse. He's French. A collaborator. <laughs> Do you guys His have some dust in your Lunetz. mouth, or...? He used to be mayor of this town. But he has now betrayed everything and everyone. But if he's a Nazi collaborator, why does he help you? Because we have photographs. Oh, yes. Because, what if it we to because blackmail has always been a also great answer. Drink. And uh, other excesses. This man is depraved. You guys still didn't answer my question. Did you have, like, dust on your in your mouths or something? Have no doubt he will do anything to save his own let me, skin. Let me see. I want to see. Has Don't show Sergeant, not the lieutenant. I need to know this information. With us two weeks ago. Bruh. And we're going to go after I'm him. just gonna. Can I? So we're gonna kill him. Can, can no. I, like. Kidnap. Oh, come on. I'm almost. I am so close. What the fuck? I couldn't really make it out. I, I mean, I could see a little bit of something, but I couldn't, like. But the fact that there's an image on the other side is interesting. I'm gonna have to come back and play it and figure out what the fuck was going on there. Anyway, yeah, no, uh, I would like to know, like, they had, like, a little bit of dust on their, on their mouths or something, or, it's a bookstore, you know, it's pretty, probably pretty dry, I wouldn't doubt it, you know, I've, I've worked on, I, I work on a shipping dock, I know what it's like to be dusty and dry and be surrounded by paper. Capture Louis Metz, Lieutenant, Nazi collaborator. Spot for our ambush, Is it? We need you to clear out the checkpoint first. If I don't have my MP40, I'm gonna be mad. I don't have my MP40. Okay, that's fine. Whatever. <sighs> I'm gonna have to work with what I got. Fuck! Are you serious? Please work. Please work. Oh, thank Christ. Where's the other one? Great work, Lieutenant. Is that We're it? MP40. No. No, 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 no. Oh, you bitches. What was, what was going on? Hell no. Pictures? I'll explain it when you're older. But Sarge, I want to know. I'm the Lieutenant. Tell me now. Fine, whatever. I'm going to fucking 
good no, I'm gonna be 40 before it's too late. Yeah, stone gavir. What is that? Car 98. That is another like gripe I have. They don't have very many guns in this. They they really centered it around just a few well known World War II weapons. They didn't have the grease gun, they don't have the Nagant. I mean, there's so many guns that they don't have in this game. I also couldn't get very far because when I was playing on the Oculus, like, the controllers, when they vibrate, it, like, throws the entire system off. So, like, when you're trying to use a mounted gun, so in a plane or on the boat missions, like, you can't properly aim because... You start to shoot the machine guns, and then your controllers seize in the game because it, I, I don't know, because some flaw design with the Oculus. Louis and his convoy will pass through here in a few minutes. He travels with an entourage of well trained troops. So we need an to. An entourage? Mwah, entourage. We set a trap. Some dynamite. I like your thinking. Of... Boom. I like your thinking. Some spigot guns in strategic spots. And. Our people positioned along the road. Uh -huh. We have to be precise. We need to neutralize everyone but Louis. No places. Lieutenant, okay. let's put the plan together. Yeah. Where do you want the dynamite? Oh, where do I want the dynamite, huh? Well, I definitely want it on one of the trucks, so we either need to put it on the bridge or put it up front. Let's put it up front because if I'm going to be positioned up there, I'm not going to have very good line of sight over here. Come on. Uh huh. There we go. Excellent choice. Boom. Okay. Now our people. Fuck the kid. All right, fine. But if I'm gonna put him somewhere, he's gonna be in the arguably safest spot there is possible. Get in that building, oh. Ollie. Be careful. Keep your fucking head down, dumb kid. All right. Juliet. Juliet. Uh, Juliet. I want you. Up here. Get up on that ridge. The sergeant? The sergeant is going to provide cover from this vantage point over here. Say on the other side. Sarge, keep your fucking head down too, and dude. Finally. Where do you want me? Well, uh, as for you, you're gonna be right over here at this bridge. Good work. Don't really care about you, so I mean I don't the know you very well. Will be here soon. You can see everything from up there. Like I said, you're you're pretty, but and I chance. mean, good luck. Not really my type. So, bye. Ah. <coughs> we really have a sniper up rifle up here, so. Fuck me. Can I shoot him, please? Oh, he's already got me pissed off. Uh, English, please? Yes, I feel like we're missing some interesting discourse here. <laughs> Why haven't you reported in? It's I like search. They know there is a spy. Be careful. You poor baby. What are the Nazis up to? Uh, winning the war? Fils de pute. Just let me I shoot him. Zero patience right now, Louis. If you think that I'm treating you bad, 
Imagine when we tell the Gestapo all about your nocturnal activities. Remember, I have pictures. <laughs> Come on, Mademoiselle, let me finish him a already. A list? Of all the resistance members in Normandy, the Gestapo's been compiling it for months. We are bringing in a trainload of special troops to round everyone up. When? I do not know. I am not privy to. Oh! Tonight! Five o'clock! Come on, let me punish him. Marcel! Oui, mademoiselle. We need to blow up a train. I'm pretty sure we were told no blowing up trains, Sarge. I'm, I'm cutting this off. Oh, no, we're going anyway. Okay. Fine. If we must, I might as well enjoy myself. Next thing you know, we're going to be blowing up Gestapo headquarters. Pfft. Foreshadowing. Train sabotage. Sabotage. Blow up the Nazi train. Fucking Nazis. So how does one become a collaborator? What are the job qualifications? Weakness? Cowardice? Or just plain self-centered opportunism. <laughs> All of the above. Unfortunately for me, we still have a little business to take care of. I cannot go back to the Gestapo looking this good. I need to look like I bravely escaped. Mm -hmm. I don't want to hurt my dreams of becoming a concert pianist. Oh, bring him over here. Come on. Lieutenant. Oh, yeah. Please do the honor. It's okay. I'm going to be <laughs> gent... Bruh. Lieutenant, time to catch a train. I'm gonna punch him Bruh. Out. Yes, do it. Go, kid. I didn't even hit him. I barely touched the side of his ready? face. Of course, mademoiselle. Okay, okay. well, I guess I'm taking cover. No, no, we're safe here. I'm pretty confident in my measurements. Are you crazy? Oh, too late. God help us. Boom. Um. Oh, shit. Ah. Well, on that note, I think it's time to fight. See? I told you. <laughs> God. Damn. Hey! Who told you you could shoot me? Whoop! Moving up! Oh god. I see documents. Ooh, pounds of faust. Sup, bitches? I'm just taking y'all shit. Propaganda, don't care about that. I'm looking for code books. Anything useful? I'm gonna just put that on for now to protect my skill. Ooh, I wonder. Come on! Ow. That was, ooh, maps. Charts. Scout tank is back. Is it? I'm trying to find any documents that I can here. 
I don't really care about it. Fuck, I've got plenty in here. Shoot the scout tank with a panzer faust. It's the only thing that will get through its armor. Bullets and grenades won't damage the scout tank. It needs something that packs a little more punch. Oh shit! I'm looking for maps! Leave me alone! Leave me alone! It's a bitch. Oh, fuck you. Oh, God! Oh, God! Get, 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 get. Syringe. Now. Great shot, Lieutenant. One more hit should do the trick. Oh, yeah? Only one more? Say that like it's easy. Fuck you! Oh my goodness. Excellent job. Bam. Meet us at the locomotive. Fuck. Move this up the lurker murder. I'm just trying to find some charts and maps and stuff, man. I feel like there's something here. There has got to be something here. <laughs> but I mean, I pretty much grabbed all the documents, didn't I? Oh, shit. Nice work, Marcel. Merci beaucoup. Oh, no, 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 no. Oh, man. Yeah, whatever. We got information, apparently. Oin the resistance. Give me a drink real quick. We have to be very careful. Since they keep the cells separate, no one knows for sure who is really in the resistance. Everyone is suspicious of each other. I know what you're okay. thinking. How can we trust this group is truly resistance? Well, some cells are not as discreet as others. They're not that bad. I wonder if they're home. I don't know. Allow me, ladies. Let's find out. Cuckoo! Take oh. your weapons. Easy. Put your hands up. Make any move and we shoot. Easy. I ain't relinquishing nothing, buddy. Hello, no. Juliette. Hello, Vincent. Oh. Are you for real? Cuckoo! Drop your weapons. Put your hands up. I'm Make in the any middle move of them. And we shoot. Follow, follow your guys Hello, lead. Hello, Vincent. You have a lot of nerve trespassing on someone else's property. I recognize you and your sister, but who is that with you? Hi! Um, Our friend is with the OSS. Lieutenant Reich. They've come to help the resistance. Lieutenant Odies. No. Hey, oh, we are just simple winemakers. We know nothing of this uh, resistance. How do we know you're not all just the Gestapo spies coming here to arrest us on false charges? We don't have time for games. We need your help. The real Gestapo is about to round up every resistance cell in Normandy. Hey, there's something coming. A German convoy. It looks like they're going to start with you. Mm -hmm. Please, we are on the same side. Prove it. Well, let's fight. Fun. I'm game. Lieutenant, we need to stay out of sight. Find a good place to hide. <laughs> yeah, where you suppose that would be right now? Excellent, Lieutenant. You're out of sight. Try not to make a sound.
Don't shoot until the Germans stop their truck. Fucking Nazis, fucking Nazis. I don't have any grenades, Juliet. And. Manon? Whatever the fuck your name is. Seriously? Fuck, 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 fuck. Shit, 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 shit. Excuse me. This is not good cover. Are you telling me there's been grenades in here this entire fucking time? And a shotgun. Shocker. Hell yeah. Okay. We believe you. We need to join forces and raid Gestapo headquarters. Sorry, just checking my ammo. Headquarters? We'll do it. Why do you have a Thompson submachine gun Thompson before the Americans even get here? We need weapons and supplies. The Germans are fortifying Pontiac. Maybe we could steal yeah, I guess Americans did, America did supply them with we weapons, but... Maybe you could use some of these uniforms and take that truck. <gasps> you could just drive right in. This is the this best is the plan, plan ever. ever. Yeah, I kind of agree that this is a terrible plan. Are you talking about infiltrating Gestapo headquarters? Point the hook. Steal weapons from the Nazis. Okay. Oh, God.
God. My little hosen. Alright, let's get this over with, boys. Nice and easy. Drive more like Hello. A what does that mean? You're Hello. all over the road. Be more precise. For the love of God, will you stop waving at them? I'm just being friendly. Hello. Oh, hello, Fritz. Oh, hello, Hans. Oh, Dieter, you're looking quite alien today. How fucking cut, stupid are you? Only request is that they shoot you first. Now, there is no worse feeling than being moved without consent in a VR game. I did not consent to this truck ride. I'm being completely honest with you guys. Oof, that's making me nauseous. Oof. Yeah, see, it just wasn't like this. Alright, what's my job right now? Grab some crates and load them into the trucks. Okay. And whoop. One crate. Two crate. Three crate. Ooh. Time to go. That way. <laughs> You guys like keep it somewhat straight. to focus right now. Get out of the way. Damn it, Fritz. Too fun. Ah, <sighs> oh, come on. Belay the coin. Send the resistance a secret message. 
Secret, secret, give me your secrets. Are you lost? No, I'm just making sure the Germans can find us. You are lost. All right, I'm turning around. Oh, my head. Voila. See? Bonjour, Hello, Juliette. Bonjour, Juliette. Excuse me. Fantastic. This is exactly what we needed. Great work. Nah, it was nothing. We almost died. <laughs> Next stop is Marcel's bookshop. He's putting together a very special bomb for Gestapo headquarters. Oula, look at that. It's a German bomber. A Heinkel 111. <sighs> Looks like the RAF got a piece of it over England. But that doesn't look good. good. <laughs> Let's hope it doesn't hit the bookshop. What is wrong with you? We better get over there. Just in case. Sure. What the hell? I don't think these German disguises are gonna work, or these Nazi disguises are gonna work for very long there, uh, Judiot. I mean, I'm very distinctly American, so... Like, I'm not sure this is gonna work very well. We have even oh boy. Present. They're rounding up all the civilians. She's a sweet girl, but in over her head. Let me handle this. Headquarters is short staffed, so they sent me down here. They are supposed to secure the area. They just took away the old man who owns the bookshop. Was he injured? No, but he sure did use a lot of interesting curse words when they put him on the truck. Juliette, I'm scared. I don't know what to do. No one is listening to me. Listen oh, up! Why are you bring so much attention you to yourself? You all know who I am. I am the girl who knows all the locals. So, I am the girl who knows the black market. I am the girl who gets the commanders, their chocolates, their wine, even their fancy perfumes for their wives, and sometimes their maîtresses. So, I am their favorite. And Emmy here is my favorite. I would recommend that you listen to her. Danke schön. Okay, that was smooth. I gotta admit, that was smooth. Time to improvise. I'll keep everyone out of the shop while you find Marcel's bomb. It should be upstairs in his secret workshop. Okay. Hurry, Lieutenant. Time okay. is of the essence. We're talking so I can get to it. Book. Well, I found the pilots for the plane. They don't look so good, but, you know, hey, it's all right, I think. Upstairs we go. I don't know what's going on with that. Tap is tight, apparently. Ooh, a record.
Um. Am I supposed to know how to play this? Around, I guess. Well, oh, marker. I am an idiot. Something in here. Something in here. Something in here. Find the cupboard key. I'm an idiot. Cupboard. Syringes and book, 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 book. F F G G C A F. Cool. Excuse me. Ugh. Hello, Leclerius. <laughs> I'll take these as well. And that. Hey, give me that thing back. You. You. And you. And you. Oh, wait, nope. I'm missing some more. Where am I missing some? Get out of here. Um, tobacco. Don't really care for it. Um, I've got a problem. I don't know what the uh, dynamite I am missing. Oh, over here. Aha! Add fuse to the bomb. Boop! Give the bomb to Zhidiot. Got everything, right? I, I really would like some ammo for this rifle, but I guess I'm not gonna get that. I don't even have a sidearm. Juliet, I have gift for you. Here you go. Merci. This will do the job nicely. Here, I pull this from behind the shelf. Play it over the shortwave radio. It's a message signaling to the resistance that the attack is about to start. Okay. Yeah, why Once not? the music plays, the Nazis will know that you're helping the resistance, so make sure you're ready. Oh. Good luck, Lieutenant. I can handle a couple Nazis. It's fine. Let's see if Gestapo headquarters. Well, I sure hope not, but, you know, if, if we see each other at Gestapo, you know, you're, that means you're, you've been made. I think you would be smart enough to try to avoid that. Alright, let's go. Record player. Alright. Ah. 
Hello, Chris. <laughs> yeah, shit. I might have went in a little over my head there for a second. I'm just gonna. I'm good now. Can I help you, sir? Oh, I need a handgun and ammo. Check that. Oh yeah, got him with the knife. Shouldn't have fucked with me, Hans. Shouldn't have fucked with me. What do we got over here? I would really, really like some rifle ammo. Please. Can I get my knife back out of him? Oof, right through the mouth. Oh, I like a Hans. I'm just gonna take that and be on my way. Can I not take the hat off? There we go. All right, uh, cool. Back up? Ah, Manon. Now we have an Whatever the fuck your name is. I can carry it. Gustapo. All right, how long have I been playing here? Oof, an hour and 13 minutes. All right, so we are going to call it a day here. And on the next episode, we will complete Gustapo headquarters. Let's just load so I can finally quit. Go shuffle headquarters, fight your it. way to the Hotel du Besson. Juliette will let us in. More about Alright, so we are gonna call it a day anyway. here. I just put these down for a second so I can let my face breathe. Oh man. Whew. That's hot. Um since the mic is currently on uh the headset, I've got to kinda hold it close to my face to talk. Uh, thank you guys so much for watching this episode. If you guys like the video, you guys know the drill. Like, subscribe, share my videos with your friends. If you want to see more VR, let me know. I know that this video is probably a lot more lively because it was in VR. So if you guys liked it, let me know in the comments down below to do if you want more. Thank you guys so much for watching as always. Have a good one.